we are ready. Yeah, but it's my face for <laughs> Hey guy, welcome to Winging It. I'm playing Arkham Horror the card game. Um, I thought this is my face reveal, but I guess it's not because my image on Facebook is my face. But this is Mrs. Winging It. And uh, we're going to play uh, Lair of Dagon. We're just uh, continuing on a campaign uh, that we've been playing since the beginning of Insmith. And uh, we are um, we're playing Nathaniel Cho and uh, Trish. And uh, I'm not going to be able to show the encounter cards because of a software glitch that I have to fix. So you're just going to have to enjoy our cheery demeanor as we get wrecked by the mythos. So anyway, we'll drop open hands and then we'll uh, get started with all the, the scenario stuff, so. Hmm. Hmm. Am I gonna need some combat stuff? Probably not. Okay. Probably you can just worry about cleaning it up. Okay. I'm going to throw away four cards. Mm, okay. Oops. Jeff, look at this. <laughs> That's nice. You know you've got a relic hunter, so... Yeah. Well, this is interesting. I guess that's a thing that I can do. I never play next to you like this. Yeah, we usually play across. I can table. see your hand. <laughs> <laughs> you can cheat. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so we are going into uh, the grand entryway here. We're exploring to find out the truth that lies under Dagon. This is um, this is her first play through this. Um, we have the Initiate version 1. Um, again, I'm sorry I can't show you guys the cards. I will uh, fix that next time we do this. Um, but the interior... Do you want to read it? Or are you showing me to read it? Okay. The interior of the old Masonic Hall is eerily quiet aside from the distant plink of dripping water and the creaking of the building under the weight of your feet. You get the feeling the arrival may have been expected. Forced. When your turn begins, if you are at a fully flooded location, you struggle for air. When your turn ends, if you did not enter an unflooded or partially flooded location during your turn, take five direct damage. Yikes. Six doom threshold. Okay. Alright, and then we have the first oath. Uh, each suspect enemy gets plus two health, loses a loop, and cannot be parlayed with. Um, and then you have, for a free trigger, you can spend the blue, red, white, or yellow key to discard each obstacle card attached to your location. Um, if each surviving investigator is at the grand entryway, that is here, and the investigators have unlocked the entrance to the caves, you can advance. Right, we have removed two cultist tokens, we have and one of the Elder Think tokens. Um, that was her choices. I did not influence her at all, and she just happened to make what I think are the right choices. Um, we are at the Grand Entryway, um, so this is uh, one shroud, zero clues, uh, is connected to each cave location. There are no cave locations. You can actually resign. You've had enough of this place. Or action, investigators at the Grand Entryway spend their purple key and uh, six clues as a group. Or remember that you have unlocked the entrance to the caves. So that's how we do this bit. We have to find the purple key. So there we go. Okay. Would you like to go first? Or do you want me to go first? I guess um, you go first. All right. Uh, I am going to spend two resources to play a Randall show. Um, he will let me search my deck for a weapon asset and put it into play. So I will find, let's see, I can at least put it out there so you guys can see it. And we are going to, of course, grab some boxing gloves, spending two resources for that, and put it into play. So we've got some boxing gloves. Got Randall as my ally. 
That's my first action. <laughs> Chat wishes us both intelligence because luck runs out. Mm -hmm. Intelligence can run out too, I can tell you, especially if the game gets long. All right, for my second action. I've up. never played this. <laughs> <laughs> she has played Arkham, but not this scenario. <laughs> I'm going to take a resource and then spend two resources to play a physical training level two. So. All right. Okay. And that is me. I really have not much to do. I guess I'll play Lucky Cigarette Case. Um, I really need to draw some cards. You are? Should I? Is that okay or should I yeah. explore? You can draw cards. So I not I have it set up at all. I guess I'll draw a card and see what I get. Oh, I got my weakness. <laughs> I had thrown that away. <laughs> yeah, of course. Um, He's self-centered. In the game. Yeah. Yeah, I guess I'll... Draw another card. Okay. Alright, still keep. Okay. Did I even shuffle? <laughs> Only you I did shuffle. can answer that question. Okay. Okay, we are at one of six doom. And I will go ahead and be lead. I'm going to okay. draw an encounter card. I get a locked door, which is just going to go here and be completely irrelevant. So let's see if you can draw as well as I drew. Nice. <laughs> no, I got an acolyte, any empty location. And okay. after enters play, place one doom on it. Okay. Where do you want to put it? Um, we can put it on one of these locations down here, and then I can walk in and maybe tank the damage, and you can walk in and get an additional clue, or maybe we don't need to do that. I don't know. All right. Um, I can walk in and just punch it. Seems good. Okay. Um, what's your, what's your game plan? Um, I need to get some cards to help me get clues. Okay. Well, then I'm just going to watch it walk in. Oh, we did. Eh, this should be flipped over. I'm going to walk in and punch the acolyte then. So action one, I'm going to move over. This uh, is a three, three shroud, two clues, victory point one. You can spend the red key. Then a, there's an audible click as a crest of blood fit. As a, the crest of blood fits into the stone altar, but the set aside statue story has set into play under your control, cursed side face up. After the hall of deep is revealed, increase its flood level. We haven't taken any tests yet, right? Because I just realized we were supposed to put, I believe, four cursed tokens into the chaos bag. That's part of the setup. But yeah, we haven't Aww. taken any tests yet. What do those do? Um, these are negative two, draw another. Hmm. Let me check the setup of this, make sure it's four. It might be five. Can I see the um, bag? Mm -hmm. um, yeah. Card? Sure. No, the card. Right there. Oh, okay. All right. Yeah, and if you draw this cultist and that, then you automatically fail. But there are no cultists in the bag. Oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> nice. Isn't that amazing? All right. Uh, five. Yes, yeah, so we got one more curse token in the bag. So there we go. All right. So putting another curse token in the bag. All right. So I'm punching. I am at five to seven, be three, second action, seven, be three. I'll just spend two resources or one resource. Off oh, physical training to be eight v three. Is there a? There's no reason to, I guess. I'll just spend two resources off physical training. Nine v three. Because why not? All right, we get a curse token. 
Another curse token. They just stack. Yeah, they just keep coming out, but they oh, come out of the bag once you once you uh, have done. Oh, that. nice. Another curse token. Oh my gosh! I swear, I doubled this. How uh, many up are you? I was uh I was up by I was at five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, so, so you're nine, good. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, four. Okay. I did shuffle these. <laughs> I, I think I shuffled them. All right. Well, anyway, he's dead. So goodbye, Mr. Uh, Acolyte. That's very close to looking like it's in my current area, but all right. Um, and I just took off the boxing boxing gloves and the top nine cards in my deck. That is the kind of deck. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. For a spirit card, yeah, cool. I'll definitely grab that card. And then I think I will just come back to you. All right. Is it good for me to get those clues now or? Um, it would be better if you got those clues after you got the red key. Okay. I think. Okay. Um. So I'm coming back. I picked up, uh, well, I could have played Glory, but I, don't, I think I don't want to. All right. I guess I'll, I'll go in here. Okay, the other first floor? Sure. Okay, it is a three shroud to clue. After it's revealed, put the set aside red key on it. Oh, there you go. Yeah. All right. Uh, and after you fail a test while investigating a hollow blood, take one horror. Was this supposed to be flooded? Yes. Yeah. Low level. Yeah. All right, there's two clues there. So, should I try to get those clues? Like, I could be one or two up. Sure. No, I could be two up. Yeah, two up's good. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna commit momentum. Okay. So then I'm two up. Like the best I can do. Okay. Zero. Excellent. Okay. Okay. Put it up there so the chat can see it. But oh, I, I mean, it doesn't matter. Now. She got zero. I can confirm it. Okay. So I get a clue. And no money. Um. And so then this means reduce difficulty by x so i can reduce it by two and you can top look at your case look at the top two cards yeah you know. i'll do that okay oh i will take this one okay so now we're testing um against one mm -hmm. and that puts me three up i was thinking of committing that is that worth it? Mm. What's the most, the highest negative in here? Negative four? Negative four. Um, let me think. So I'm at four B one. That's, I could just commit this and sure. Okay. I don't think it's bad. I never use these. Okay. Intel report on commit that. Mm -hmm. So I'm five up. And what is this? This is a negative three. Mm -hmm. Okay. You can also check and see it. Oh, okay. Actually, maybe I don't see it up there. I don't know. Okay, so you got the, that, and so you get a clue. Nice. Does that mean I pick up the key? Uh, yes, it does. And okay. you can crack the case if you had one. Oh, you hand. know what? Is it worth it? Is that like the highest shroud we have around here? I think it's three three resources is pretty good for not doing anything. Do you need <laughs> Do you need resources? No, I'm good. Okay, I'll do that. You sure you don't need resources? I'm fine. Okay. I have a standing up. Okay. So that was the reaction. Yep. Okay. I didn't put my thingies. You don't need to. Okay. I just like the track them. They're there for your uh, convenience. All right. Uh, so let's do upkeep. How many resources do you have? Um, 
eight. Eight. Okay. All right, we are at two doom, and I will draw an encounter card. I get Herald of the Deep. It's test three willpower. And Five instead if your location is flooded. For each point you fell by, add one curse token to the chaos bag. So I'll I'll commit I'll spend two on physical training. That'll get me to five v three. All right, that is uh, negative um, three. If you fail, place each key you control on your location. Okay, so I put one curse token in the bag. It's not so bad. Uh, Try to okay. shuffle it in. No. My turn for bad days. Peril. <laughs> <laughs> Should I read it? Yeah. Okay. Choose a location where there's at least one investigator. Increase that location's flood level. Um, each investigator at chosen location takes one damage. If the chosen location's level is not increased, tidal alignment gains surge. Well, um, I guess um, since we're kind of done in there, I'll, I'll do it in my location. Okay, makes sense. You so, take a damage? Yeah. Damage token. All right. Um, let's see. Do you have to have all the keys off here? You don't to get the 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 um. Do we? Yeah. Do we want to do that? Yeah, I think you would need to move there in. Do that. I just move, move, and that's my action. Spend the key. Yeah. But I mean, if you know, you don't have to. If there's something else you want to play that's more important this turn. Um, you mean like an ally? Like a uh, Lolo Santiago, for instance. Not that I can see your hand. <laughs> but if that's all I'm gonna do, I don't need Lola. Okay. Right away. No. Okay. Sure. I'll just do that. Okay. Yep. All right. Uh, so we spend the key. It goes on the okay. here, and you get. The statue, it goes the uh, first side up, right? This is the, okay. So it has an action. You can exhaust it and add two curse tokens to the chaos bag and deal one damage to a humanoid enemy at your location. Or you can take an action to spend the blue, white, red, or yellow key and ready it, flip it to its other side. How would we, do we, can we get the red key back? No. I don't know why it says oh, okay. the red key. <laughs> so this is, this is my asset now? Mm-hmm. Okay. Alrighty. Okay. Um, I am going to... I think... Move. Action one. I will play Stand Together with you. So you draw two cards and two, two resources. Oh, thank you. Man, I'm so rich, and I don't even have Milan right now. I will then spend five to play Gret Wagner. My last action. The level up Gret. So. Oh, which she uh, knocks Cho out, but that's okay. Not too worried about it. All right, that is my turn. Okay. All right, let's do a key. Oh, that's a. Uh, not there yet. Try a card. Add a resource. Okay. Uh, now we're at uh, three doom. Is that true? So we've done. This I think is, so. Yeah, third round of encounters. Okay. And I get a uh, stone barrier. So you attach it to the nearest location. I wish we should be holding those in front of the camera. No, it's good. Right there. Right oh. here is fine. Uh, you attack the nearest location without stone barrier. Uh, if attached location is flooded, stone barrier gains surge. While stone barrier is ready, investigators cannot move out of the attached location. You can test agility, combat, or intellect. If you succeed, to exhaust the stone barrier. So, Where do you want to put it? Yeah, we have to put it right here. Where we are? Yeah. Okay. That's my encounter. Okay. And I get... Esoteric Ritual. Test four willpower. If you fail, 
Either choose and discard two cards from your hand or discard an asset you control. Oh, if you draw a curse token, you have to do both. Okay, I'm probably going to fail this. Yeah, being Trish. <laughs> well, I could test even, but I don't really want to spend that. Yeah, I like a cigarette case. You know, I can throw away two of these cards. Okay. I think. Yeah, I guess so. Okay. Okay, I'm testing 2v4. There's a plus 2 in here, right? <laughs> uh, that would be her Elder Sign. Okay, Elder Sign. Curse token. Oh, no. Okay, so uh, I just fail, or do I draw again? You draw again, but you're going to have to get rid of her. You have to do both effects, which is... Goal, negative 1. Negative 1 for each Okay. Opinion. So, um... Curse comes out. Yeah. Okay, so I have to discard an asset and then choose two cards from my hand. Yeah. Okay. Is it... The only asset you have is look. Okay, so I have... Yeah, I can't discard any of those. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um... Is your discard pile here? Oh, yeah. Is it there? Okay. And then I will discard these two cards. I already have one of each. Sounds good. Okay. All right. So what's our plan for getting out of here? We want to get both clues and leave. I know is what we want to do. Okay. Um, have to get out or bad things are going to well, happen? No, it's just that if we don't leave the next turn, we we have to wait till next turn. But the stone barrier of like we're going to we either want to exhaust it or we're just kind of stuck here for a turn. So basically, I just have to get two clues and move. You can uh, test the thing. Well, I could test the thing, yes. That's the thing I could do. Because I do have some stuff I need to put down, but... Do you think you can get two clues and move? I can get one easily. Um... Now, otherwise, we can just hang out here for another, another, another round. But then I don't need to exhaust the stone barrier. I think we have to stay here because it's fine. I can't get two clues, and I mean, okay. I'm only one up. I mean, you could, you could potentially uh, use if you if you were going to use Lola, you could use her ability to get one of the clues, but that still means playing her. Oh, well then, yeah, I don't have I won't have another action to move. Play her, investigate, use her ability, and then move. Wait. Play her. Oh, this is fast. Actually, I can play her. Do that. Do this fast. I'm and then we get another it. action. <laughs> yeah, and then I can play this too because I want to play this too. Sure. All right. Okay. So then let me let me do the stone barrier. So I'm okay. uh, testing at five, six, b two. Not the one six b two. Testing the stone barrier. Plus one. All right. So it is exhausted. Um, and then I will move out of here. And I guess I will draw a card. No, I'm going to spend one resource to play the Waveborn Idol. All right. Seems good. All right, that's me. Okay, I will play Lola. I can I can afford this. Oh, this is expensive. Um, I will spend three. Mm -hmm. Discover a clue. Um, so I have two more actions. Mm -hmm. So, hmm. Okay, I'll do this working a hunt real quick. And get another clue. So I got both of these. Mm -hmm. So I still have two more action. Mm -hmm. That was fast. So I was thinking of playing an asset and then getting out. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'll play lockpicks. And then 
move out there. Okay, well, you're gonna have to warm up some leftovers. They're in the fridge. <laughs> <laughs> That's what happens when they don't eat dinner. That's exactly what happens when they don't eat dinner. Okay. But that's uh that's it, right? Oh yeah. you get three um you get three supplies on your lockpicks. Oh, okay. Thank you. All right. Again, chat, sorry okay, that I'm not you... showing the cards. I will next time. Wait. Did we do upkeep? Yeah. Did I do. I didn't do upkeep? Not yet. Wait, so what are we doing right now? Upkeep. Yep. Okay. I was just explaining, I was apologizing for not being able to show first. Hey Davey. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so our, our app, uh, I was using the most recent build and it uh, was not able to, something went wrong and I wasn't able to show the, the cards, the encounter cards. So this is a little bit more of a dry stream, but you get to see our lovely faces and we'll just try to entertain you with our winning personalities. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, okay, uh, so we're at uh, four of six doom. And encounter card, I will get... Secret Gathering. Um, add uh, one curse token to the chaos bag and test four willpower. Okay, so. so much willpower. Yeah, there's a lot of willpower in here. I never have any. Oh. Rogue life. Yeah, yeah. All right. Uh, so I and then for each point you fail by, if you fail, place one zoom on each cultist enemy and take one horror. I don't think I care actually that much. But I'll still uh, spend two off physical training to be up by one. I need to take 50% responsibility. I guarantee you it was my fault. It was that big refactor I just did. All right, so this is uh, negative three. If you fail, place each cube. Okay, well, whatever. So I still have to, this is, if you fail, place one doom on each cult to me and take one horror. Okay, so. I take a horror, and by me taking a horror, I do mean that Gret Wagner takes a horror. So, I'm okay. Alright, you gonna counter? I can't read this. So this is G. I was gonna try. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I mean, you can say that my okay. is correct. Um, Peril, you must decide. Each investigator loses three resources. How many do you have? I have two. You can see it up there if you want. Oh, okay. Um, each investigator takes two horror. Place one doom on the current agenda. Hmm. Probably the doom. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I guess we'll go broke. Yes. Okay. Pretty much you always go broke on this one. Okay. This is actually, this card is like one of the things, one of my complaints about this cycle is just this card. I don't like it. It's not too bad in two player, but in four player. Why is player, it called Syzygy? Um, so Syzygy is like things colliding, combining. I don't know. Okay. I don't, I, I'll look it up. Yeah, chat, chat, probably somebody in chat knows. They can tell us. All right. Uh, so that was yours, right? So we're good to go now. Yeah. Okay. So what is your yeah. what is your plan? Yeah, that's not doing anything. It's just hanging okay, out. Okay, I would like to at least put this asset down, but actually, I don't have any money. Never mind. <laughs> um, I guess I'll move and investigate. Synergy is the alignment of plants, often he uh, heralding a catastrophic event. Mm. So there you go. And it would be something bad. <laughs> because there is something good in this game. Yeah. All right. Do you want to go first? Uh, what is your plan? To move and get some clues. Okay. Um, I'll move and I'll move, I'll move into the uh, second floor hall. Okay. So I'll move here, action one. Actually, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to clear your self-centered. That's what I'm going to do. Oh, thank you. So unself-centered. <laughs> yeah, so, so that you can commit cards. And then I'll move up here to the uh, thought floor. I didn't even think about that. I could have done that. That's fine. My, your actions are way more valuable. Okay, so this has an action to spin the black key. Remember that you have unlocked the third floor. And I bet you the purple key is up in the third floor. <laughs> you're, <laughs> just... you're, you're a smart lady. <laughs> okay, investigators cannot move into the third floor hall until an investigator has unlocked the third floor. It's, you know, the theme. It's yeah. tripping with theme here. Okay, 
So uh, that's where I'm at. Okay, so we need the black key to get the purple key to get back here and leave. Yes. Okay. Well, not leave. We could leave anytime we want. No, yeah, we can leave anytime we want. Okay. You can check out anytime you want, but you can't. No, that's not the way it works. Okay. Yeah. All right. I'll just move and move in one of these rooms. Sounds good. Okay. What have we got? All right. Fast trigger, spend blue, red, white, or yellow, and you can heal damage, draw two cards, gain three resources, add four blessed tokens to the back. Mm -hmm. I haven't seen any blue, white, yellow keys. Yeah, this card is actually weird, and I'll explain why afterward. But a lot of the, a lot of these things you actually can't do. And nobody knows really why, so. Hmm. I said I explained it afterwards, but I'm explaining it right now. We did see the red key, but we already used it, so. Yeah. Um. All right, I will investigate. I'm at four, five, six, seven. Or I mean, should I save it? I mean, you could use block picks, and you'll be up by a bazillion. Oh, I do have those down. Yeah, I forgot. Okay. Um. Okay, so my base is eight with this, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. Nine. That's really good. I could still use deduction because I only have one action left. Sure. Okay. 10, 11. Sounds good. Okay. This is like the perfect setup for an auto fail. Okay. It's a skull. Minus one. Oh. I already dropped it back. It's fine. <laughs> okay, so yeah, there, there, that may be true, Debbie. I haven't done every different uh, variation of the axe, so um, about or I've had different things in the campaign logs. So maybe that's the part that I'm missing. All right, okay, so, so wait, I was eleven before, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, so I succeeded by six. Mm -hmm. So I get to. Oh, I don't have a lucky secret case. No. It got thrown away. Sadness, sadness. But you did get the clues. Yeah. Um, Jenny wants to come down and see it, the basement. Oh, his mom wants to come see the basement. Um. Okay. You can you can tell her. We're we're gonna have a slight interruption as uh, somebody's gonna come down and visit. They want to see our new renovated basement. They're gonna to want to talk to us for a while. Huh? Well, they're gonna want to talk for a while. Well, I can explain that we're in stream. Okay. <laughs> Hold on just a second, folks. Okay, um, I don't want to lose my spot. You have, have you gone yet? Uh, I have gone. So we're going to be at... Upkeep. Yep. Okay. So guys, uh, I put you on hold for just a second. We'll be right back. Sorry for the interruption. But, uh, real life. All right, we're back. Apologies for that. Being good neighbors, or 
parents or people or something. Yeah. All right, let's do upkeep. Okay. Oh, that's a card that I like. All right. I have still haven't got my special man. Your special man? I am your special man. <laughs> the other one. <laughs> the other one. The rich one. Nobody can compete with Milan, <laughs> folks. Yeah. <laughs> Where are you? All right. Uh, yes, the basement is too nice. Let's see. Yes, indeed. All right, we're putting a doom on the threshold. We're the doom on the threshold. Doom on the agenda. We're at five and six doom. We're about to advance. And drawing an encounter card, I get an acolyte. Okay. That is, uh, I'm just going to put him over here. No. Well, there's going to be a doom on him? Yeah, there's going to be a doom on him, but it doesn't matter because it's witching hour. Okay. So we can just let this guy, I could put it here and just plan on killing him. Maybe that's okay. Why do you want to kill him? Because it looks me surface to my deck for cards. Oh. Or you could put him here. Yeah, but you're going in there. Right. But you, you could go first. That is true. That is true. All right. All right. Yeah, we'll put him there. That's fine. Okay. All right. And then you're in counter. Okay. Title alignment. Well, this is going to happen to me again. <laughs> okay, so I have to choose a location, increase the flood level, take a damage. So I'll do I'll just do where I am. Okay. I can give it to Lola. Indeed. Where are the tokens for that? I need those. Okay. Okay. All right, so I will go kill that acolyte, I suppose. So I, um, because I do know things, uh, action one, I'm going to take a resource. Action two, I'm going to move into the second floor hall. Uh, it's the Hall of Rebirth, a two shroud, one clue. After you reveal Hall of Rebirth, draw the set aside Apostle of Dagon enemy. So here he is. All right. He's a two five two. After a puzzle, a puzzle of Dagon enemy or enters play, place set aside a black key on it. Okay. When an investigator deals one or more damage to the Apostle of Dagon, add one curse token to the chaos bag. Hmm. So I would like to point out that this is not an elite. Okay. Oh, so I can use the teachings of the order. Yes. To defeat him? Yes. Okay. That's, that's the thing that you could do. Let's if, do if, it. Let's okay. do it. <laughs> just, just pointing that out. Okay. Just pointing that out. Okay. So anyway, I'll use my last action to point, punch this acolyte. Uh, I'm up by a very, very much. I'm glad you pointed that out. Because <laughs> I have no idea why I'm carrying around this book. This poem. I'm sorry to commit a card. Uh, so I'm gonna have to get rid of a card. I'm gonna commit Gretz. Oh, there's a clue there too. Alright. So Gret, Gret can get you a clue. She can, if we want that clue. I don't think we hear about that clue though. Okay. Um, because not a victory point. Alright, so I'm at, uh, five, six, seven, eight to beat three. I don't know, I just think it's always nice to have at least one clue. <laughs> to have a clue. First, eight, seven, six to beat three. A tablet, which is... Negative three. Negative three. So I'm glad I committed her. Yeah. I was right, right? I was at five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, eight, seven, six, five, four. Actually, I didn't need to commit her, but whatever. Okay. So I could get that clue. Do you think I should? I don't think... I don't know if any of your cards require you it's not a victory point. to have a clue. You yeah. know, from... Okay. I will, um, I'll exhaust boxing gloves and look through the top 12 cards for a spirit card. Nine cards. Did I say 12 earlier? I hope I didn't cheat earlier. 
I don't remember. We uh, you missed the that. Oh yes, <laughs> yeah. It's uh, it, well because you would think the sky's elite, and you, it, you have to look, figure it out. So yeah, um, anyway, you can do your thing. You're gonna find your card. Yeah, but you can. Okay. Move, move. I'll exhaust this thing. Um, and defeat him. Yep, and you get the key, and he goes into the victory display. So. Is it just exhausted for one round, and then? Yep. Okay. Um, and then I will move back. No, yeah, because you don't want the clue. Oops. Okay. Cool. Unless it's better for me to be with you. Should I stay with you? Nah, it's fine. We're good. Um, because I can't, I don't have any money to do anything. Can't play anything. All right, so then we do upkeep. I'm gonna have to drop a card. Wait, what is this? Oh, that's the rest of my deck. I thought my deck was feeling kind of thin. How many resources do you have? Two. Okay. I'm sure I uh, got all this correct. All right, uh, getting my card. Um, that's probably a good card. Hard to say. I'll just get rid of it for now. I think I'm gonna loot my deck. All right. Uh, and you got your card and resource. Okay. Well, the agenda agenda advances. Okay. And we get. Let's see. Uh, encounter in the deep. In a flooded hall of the Order, you come across an onyx statue depicting a creature similar to the one you saw in Double Reef. Just as you ponder the nature of its existence, you hear. A uh, faint chanting up ahead, some words that I can't pronounce. Before you can interrupt the stain, strange syllables, there's a splash behind you. You hide and hold your breath as the figure approaches. The gentle sloshing of their steps pass, pa passes and then fades into the distance. Um, you shadow the figures, following them to their site of the ritual. Add two curse tokens to the chaos bag. And then what? If a jailbreak is listed under memories recorded, yep. is it? It is. Spawns set aside suspect enemy at right, a is... third floor location. Mm -hmm. Athura Gilman. Okay, or at the grand entryway if a third floor location is not in play. Right. So we can okay. spend three uh, No, we can't do the parlay. So and she gets uh, she gets extra health, right, or she doesn't? Was then. Oh, it's it... it's yeah, it's it's right here. She gets yeah. It says gets plus two health, so she's got seven health. Okay. All right. So she gets here, and what key does she have on her? Mm, blue key. All right. Okay, so she is here. Where is it? Right. Okay. So All we right. just have to kill her? Yep. Uh, okay. What lurks below, it's the same forest as before, flooded and all that kind of stuff. All right, now we got drawing counters. Okay. And we have a 16 threshold. Okay. All right, we get mysterious chanting. So we put two doom on her because she's a cultist, right? No, she's not a cultist somehow. She's a suspect. Okay. All right, so we got to search for a cultist. We'll go ahead and grab. Mm. What's a bless token do? Plus two, draw another. Mm. Do we want to um, spend the key and do that? To what? Add blood tokens? No, I don't think so. What am I doing with the black key? You're going to take an action to unlock oh, yeah, it there. You can unlock it. But yeah. if you. Oh, you can't even do it over there. Never mind. Yeah, I think I'll just grab an initiate of Dagon and put it here. Okay. 
And there's actually an argument for putting it here, because when we advance, I might get rid of it, so I'll put it there. All right. I may regret that, but we'll see. Get your uh, encounter. Oh. Sizz. G. <laughs> oh, man. How many resources do you have? Uh, I have three resources. Do you need them? We can't talk. That's peril. Oh, we can't talk. Mm-hmm. All right, everyone takes two. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Everyone loses their resources. Uh, I'm sorry. Do you want two horror? Uh, I don't know. It, it's tough to say in that case because of, you know, it's really hard to say. Um, okay. I'm sorry. No, no, no. Don't apologize. It's fine. Um, this guy doesn't need anything yet. Okay, lady. All right. So... What is our plan? You've got to spend the black key to get in there. I can't walk in there. What? Can you evade her? Um, yeah. Yeah, I can evade her. I'll be at seven. I mean, you don't necessarily have to. We could set up for next turn going in. Okay. If we just want to do that. You can spend the black key and then just, you know, get her, you know, do you have any setup stuff you need to do? Well, I don't have any money. It's just like nothing, you know? Yeah. I mean, like, even if I pulled Milan or something, I would need four resources. Yeah, I'm probably just going to move in and take two resources. Um, I could draw some cards and look for something to fight because, I mean, but I think all my fighting stuff costs. Yeah. Resources. Yeah. No, I agree. But at least you can unlock that, and then I can move in first and kill Athera. So yeah, I'm just going to move here and take two resources. That's my Okay, plan. you're saying for me to go in there and evade her? No, I'm saying you can just spin the black key to unlock it, and the next Oh, we that's go. an action? Yeah. Yeah, okay. All right, I'll spin the black key. It goes on here. Mm hmm Okay, and then I will... Let me... Yeah. What? No, if you had resources, there was something you could do, but I forgot you found resources. What is it? You could, you know, you could get discover a clue with Lola and evade Athera, but you'd have to have... Oh yeah, I haven't used my special ability one time. Um... Yeah, if I... Yeah. Okay. I'm just gonna draw a card mm -hmm. and see what I get. Hmm. I have two more actions, right? One more action. Oh, yeah, because I did the thing. All right, I'll take a resource. Okay. Okay. All right, so let's uh, do upkeep. <laughs> of course, of course, of course. Um... Now I can stand together. All right, uh, we're at 162. And we're drawing an encounter card, and I get the Cenarian Deep One. After he engages you, add two curse tokens to the cast bag. So I'll just put it here. The 232. Two. All right. And it's your turn. Um, yeah. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Fulfill the oaths. What are we on? Act one. Okay. Test three agility. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, I'm at five. And... I guess I'll go... Um... I guess I'll go up to six. Mm-hmm. Because you wanted me to evade her, right? At some point. Uh, so I can hang on to this. Actually, I don't need, need to evade her. If I put this down. Yeah. I can spin that. Yeah, and then evade her again. Yeah. Should I use this then? 
Uh, I, I I definitely use that over Pathfinder. Why do you have another Pathfinder? Oh yeah. <laughs> I don't know. It's... Okay, four, five, six, seven. Mm-hmm. Okay. Number three is pretty good. Okay. Minus one. Put it out there. Oh, <laughs> sorry. Seeds so start okay. apart from the uh, manual deck. Yes, I know. Okay. Oh, and that's it. That was the end of it. That's all you do. Yep. Okay. And but if I was to fail, I take damage. Yep. Hmm. Okay. So let me go first. So you're gonna evade Athera, I think. That's what you're saying, right? Yeah. All right. I might do it just by getting a clue, I guess. That's fine. Um, then I am going to let me see the bag. I am going to. Um, I'm going to play Monster Slayer uh, against this Scenarian Deep One. I'm going to spend two on physical training. Oh, wait, that's a Deep One. Thing. Yeah, okay. That, that, I couldn't use that yet. Okay. So I am at uh, five. I'm at five, six, seven, eight, two. two. Minus three. Okay. That guy's dead, because you're using Daniel's ability. And we get two exhaust boxing gloves. Two nine cards, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. The first thing we care about. Maybe. Maybe that's a good card you have. Okay. Then I am going to play Stand Together with you. So well, thank two you. Two cards and two resources. Oh, I get uh, Big Phobia and Tommy Malloy. That's uh, super unfortunate, actually. How did you draw two? That's what happens to stand together. You draw two cards. Oh, those are your two cards? Yep. Oh, that's terrible. Th this actually does frustrate my ability to do something with Athera Gilman, unfortunately. Um, so I will uh, spend two resources to play a one two punch against Tommy. I'm at uh, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Two minus three, that's one damage. Got the damage tokens. And then second punch, one, two punch. Is minus three? Minus three, so takes two damage, and that is the end of my turn. All right. If he would have, if he was exhausted, I could damage him. I, I, I've got him. I, I, wait, exhausted? How so? The sneak attack. Oh, it's fine. Um, you could do that to a thoroughbred though. If you go in and invade her, I, I'll, I'll kill him. Don't worry about that. Do you need me to clear that? No, I, I, I'll, I'll get it eventually. You just want me to go in there and evade her? Go in there, evade her, get clues, sneak attack her, okay. all that kind of good stuff. Oh, somehow I have nine cards. Because uh, we just did stand together. Oh, so I get to keep these for now. Yep. Okay. All right, I'll go in here. Third floor has two clues. After it's revealed, put the set aside purple key on it. Called it. Um. After you fail, you have to add a curse token to the bag. Yeah. Fail an investigate or anything. After you fail a skill test. Okay. Okay. 
So I am going to really quick sleight of hand put down this obfuscation. I have three charges. I need charges. Yep. Okay. So I'll spend one to investigate. Um, uh, should I do lock picks? And why not? Okay. Is that a victory? No. I still don't really need those clues. Let's see, we need nine clues here. How many do we have? Or six clues there. We got all the clues we need. Okay. I'll just, I'll do lock picks. Okay. Uh huh. So I'm at eight, nine. Um, you can't go up more than that. I mean, there's cursed tokens, so. All right, well, I'll add this. Here we go. Okay. To be 10. 10 before. Or should I go up to 11? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. Uh, well, that will draw me a card. Well, That's okay. That then you're going to sneak it back, right? Yeah. Okay. Put it out there. Minus two. So now I'm at eight before. Now I'm at six, six before. You can oh do it. You God. can do it. You can do it. <laughs> Failed. All right. Because that's a minus three. It is a minus three. And I have to place each key control on your location. You don't control any keys though, so. Oh, that's right. But you do break a lock pick. Yeah, and yeah, and I already spent that. Um, I have one more action though, right? Mm-hmm. I guess I'll try to investigate again. You were at eleven, right? I was at ten. You were at eleven. You were at because, 10. wait, eight, nine, ten. 11. She gives you for lock. Oh, it's 11. So I passed. I passed. Yes. So I did not break my lock picks. You did. Oh. Yes, because you, you have to succeed. Oh, by, by two. Okay. But it doesn't okay. matter because. And you still get to do you, you, you your Rika. Okay. And you I did not agility. count that agility. I forgot about that. <sighs> okay. Uh, and I, I think you're evading her with your ability. Yeah. So that was all my actions. You. No, I have one more action. Sneak, one more action. Oh yeah, I have to sneak attack her. Yeah. yeah. So. Okay, hold on. Let me find it. It's gonna clean me out, but. It's worth it's worth damaging her. Yeah, because okay. she's she's uh, seven health. Okay. Okay, two damage. Awesome. All right. Uh, so then the enemy phase. Uh, she will ready on you. Okay. And then um, I will uh, have a. Uh, Counter punch, Tommy. Are my boxing glove was exhausted. I don't. I didn't kill anything last turn. Oh, I did the snaring thing. Okay. All right, we're at. Uh... Five, six, seven, eight, two, two. Nice too. Tommy's dead. Nice. So, not too bad, I guess. I feel like the last time we played, I did nothing but like. <laughs> but what? Like, like the last time we played, remember? I just like could never get any of my stuff out, and and uh, we saw how we succeeded. We did fine. Yeah, we did. We did well. Um, this purple key is here. Oh, so in order to get the purple key, you got to get the other clues. So we do need the clues there. Oh man, I could have used a deduction. You could have. I forgot about that. My bad. Oh. Sorry. It's all good. Well, you can evade her again. <laughs> all right. Uh, all right. So, what do we have to keep now? Uh, 
Oh, I got my weakness. Well, that's a good thing you have obfuscation. <laughs> Shadow agents. I'm going to have to evade them, actually, yeah. so I can discard them. Yeah. All right, so we'll see how it goes. Uh, we're at three of six doom, and I'm drawing a card. I get this guy. We're in act one. Yes. All right, so I'll put it here. Uh, so I am at 2v3, and it's going to be a damage. It'll be fine. Hmm. And I get minus one. I, I fail, I take a damage. But you're even then. I was oh, three, I, I was thinking you had three. Yeah. Never mind. All right, and then your encounter. Okay. Oh, and uh, because of this, I have to take a horror. Because, ouch. So. Oh, man. Yeah. All right. This is the one I always fail. Yeah. Esoteric ritual. Mm hmm. Um, and if I draw a curse token. I have to do, I have to both discard an asset, gosh, and discard two cards from my hand. And we'll put a curse token in because of the Hall of Silence. How many curse, curse tokens are in there right now? Six. Oh, man. Okay. I could use this in test even. <laughs> Good card. Yeah, but last time I just had to throw it away. True, true. Should I just bank on failing this? I would I would just bank on failing that. Okay. Our first token. Yeah. Alright. 2v4. Oh. Plus one! I still failed! <laughs> I could have just even. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. Yeah. But it still means it can be a lucky cigarette case, so... Okay, so I just have to choose. So I will discard two cards on my hand. Um, one, Pathfinder, and... Um, is there any, are there any more clues we're getting? Are we getting more clues, Jeff, besides uh, that one? Uh, yeah, we'll be getting more clues. Um, I'll discard... I'm going to discard my other Pathfinder, too. Okay. I'm never going to be able to afford this. Okay. Okay. Yeah. That's hard to decide. Okay, no, I'll keep it. No. No, I'll discard this Perception. Okay. Okay, so... I've got issues of not being able to kill a Thera. I have to do five damage. I can move in. She's not massive, right? No. I can do I can do four damage easily enough. But not five damage. I can kill the shadow agents. But as soon as I evade them, they're gone. So that's kind of easy for me to do. Right, because of obfuscation. Yeah. What are, what are the what does she do? She's too horror? That's gross. Okay, um... She can stay on me. I can take too horror for one round. So you're gonna do obfuscation to get the key? To get the clue? Yeah, get rid of these guys. And then, I mean, I could try to evade her just with, um... I mean, I'm at five. Yeah. Okay. Well, I guess why don't you go first and see what happens. Okay. So I'm going to obfuscate. Mm -hmm. And... You have to obfuscate both, because we're both going to attack you. Fine. Mm -hmm. Obfuscate both of them. And now there's a useless app that I can throw away. This is true. Yeah. You can try to uh, evade her first, so you wouldn't have to use the obfuscation. Oh, true. Because I have to do that anyway. Um, okay. All right, fine. 
5v3. There's a better way. One plus one. Oh, Elder Sign. Yeah. I don't I forgot what that even does. Throw it out there. Okay. Um, it's it's only good for investigates, but whatever. Oh, <laughs> lame. But I mean, you pass. So okay. He evaded those. So she's evaded. Mm -hmm. And then now I'll investigate and I'll obfuscate these guys. Okay. And so I'll use the lock picks. Mm -hmm. Um. So I'm at eight, nine, ten. And I'll I'll start the action with some midnight oil. Uh no, because the, the, if you do that, you can't use the investigation on the lock picks. Why? Uh, because it's the investigate action on the card, which is the same as the investigate action on the. Uh, you can only use it one time. You you can only use it one time, and you can only use it on a on a pure investigate action. Okay, but I am investigating. Right, but if you're using lock picks, that's the investigate action on lock picks. Okay, whatever you say. <laughs> okay. Um. Fine. So I'm at eight, nine, ten, and um, against four. That's pretty good. Okay. Okay. Now I'm at eight, four. Mm -hmm. Minus two. Minus zero. Oh, minus two. Yes, 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 you're right. Yeah. yeah. Um, Alright, so you pass. Uh, yeah, it was two up. Yeah. I just realized so we, these we are should have another curse token in the back because you failed that test in there, but we'll just throw this one back in. Okay. We'll, we'll call it it will call it a day. Okay, so is that key automatically mine? It is. I mean it doesn't have to be, but it makes sense for it to be. Okay. And I didn't break my lock picks. That was two up. Uh no. You drew oh, you were at ten. Yeah, I went to yeah, eight and six. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. You have two actions left. Oh really? I did all that. Didn't don't you have to, oh no, because you evaded and then you okay. I evaded and then I investigated. Yeah, so So one action left. That's right. Should I move back down? Well, um we're gonna have to go up and kill her. I think we want to kill her. Um, so just stay here? Yeah, it's easier for me if you just stay there. All right, I'll take a resource. Yeah. Okay. All right, um, so I am going to action one. In action two, I'm going to spend two resources and play safeguard so that I can go with you. Okay. Um, and then action three, I am going to clean them out. I am at uh, five, six, seven, or five, six, seven, eight. And I get two resources, clean them out. Versus three. Plus one. Okay, awesome. So she's up to four damage. You have to put two damage on her. Great. Okay. And then she engages me. And we do a key. Okay. All right. We are at. Four of six doom. I'll draw an encounter card. I get locked door. Goes right here. Your encounter. Okay. Mm -hmm. Secret gathering. Add one curse token to the chaos bag. Test four willpower. If you fail, place one doom on each cultist enemy. And take one horror. To her instead, if one or more curse tokens were revealed. So there, she's not cultist, but I'm gonna have to take a horror if I fail. This guy's a cultist. Oh, that guy's cultist. Yeah, which means that we have to kill her or else we advance. We have to kill this one. Yeah, or else we advance if you fail this. But that's probably doable. Actually, we we're probably fine. We're probably fine. 
Um, again, I could use this to be even. I think that's worth it. No. No. I don't think okay. it's worth it. I think it's uh, I think it's a really good price. Especially since I already got through my weaknesses. Yeah. Okay. Um, we did upkeep, right? So this is not exhausted. That's correct. Okay. All right. Two before. <laughs> elder sign, elder sign, elder sign. No. <gasps> <laughs> show, show it. They're not going to believe you. <laughs> okay. So there was two tokens in my hand and I was like, which one might be the elder sign? <laughs> oh my gosh. For once, this game is nice to me. Don't say things like that. What? Don't say things like that. It's terrible. <laughs> I'm just saying. Okay. Okay, so I passed the treachery. You did. You did. Nice. All right. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and just kill Athera, if that's okay. Yeah. So, let me see. Dang. Uh, I am at five, six, seven, eight. We're going to commit overpower. 9, 10, and we're using uh, Monster Slayer. So we're at 10 v 3. 5, 6, 7, 8. All right, that is minus 3. So I succeed by 2, I get to draw 2 cards. She is dead because Monster Slayer. I thought that was minus four. Minus four. I'm still enough though, right? Because I was at. I don't know. Yeah, you're right. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven minus four. Yeah, I still succeed by two. Okay. So she takes three damage. And uh, yeah, that's seven health. Yeah. So she, and I get the blue key. Okay. All right. Cool. I get to draw two cards. She is in the victory display. I am going to take two actions to clear this thing. Uh, I will also spend a resource. I could clear for you if you need to do something. Uh, I think it's better for you to get here and to spend the clues to, to advance. Okay. I'm going to draw two cards playing Glory. Okay. Cool. All right, so that is that. I, I didn't go. Nope, that's that for me, I mean. Okay. Yep. So I'm just gonna go down there and... We advance. Use my purple key? Yep. Okay. So I'm gonna play Pathfinder. And tap it to move, and then I will... I'll safeguard with you. <clears throat> okay. Then move again. Mm -hmm. Second action. And third action, we will spend the purple key and six clues. And remember that we unlock the entrance. Okay, and now we can advance. So we get secrecy. Does it wait? Does the purple key go here? Yes. Okay. Yep. Each of the order's chambers are devoted to an aspect of their grand scheme. The secret that lies at the foundation of the order, the poison that dwells in the roots of the Insmith. But whatever the secret is, is just beyond your grasp, at least until the moment you discover the truth behind the building itself. It is nothing but a cover for the order's true headquarters. As you unlock the pathway that leads to the cavernous depths beneath the building, you wonder what the secrets could possibly dwell below. If a suspect enemy is in play, removed from the game. It's not. Remove each location other than the grand entryway from the game, or add them to the victory display if they have the victory X with no clues on them, discarding each card at those locations. So, uh, this gets discarded. We have two victory. goes in the victory display. And these are all ran from the These end. go back to the treasuries? Yeah. They're coming back. Okay. At some point. All right. And um, shuffle the set aside title tunnel locations and put each of them into play. Okay. So title tunnel locations are here, pre-shuffled. This uh, is not flooded. 
right. Doesn't that make sense? So all those are connected to the center? Yes, but they're not connected to each other. Okay. We have more error. Can you grab some more error? I think there. There we go. All right. And then we have to increase the flood level of each location. You have all the flood stuff. You do have all the flood stuff. And, interestingly enough, because I can exhaust this wave worn idle, right? When your location's flood level changes, then I can take another action. So I will spend two resources to play down Bandolier. Yeah. In my body slot. All right. Uh, so, okay. And then uh, shuffle the set aside synergy and title alignment cards into the encounter deck along with the encounter's power. So those cards that we've been hitting, they shouldn't have been in there. I set this <gasps> up wrong. Wait, we've been... Yeah. And Oops. we've it's been making us poor. Yes. I'll sleep on the couch. It's okay. <laughs> like you've ever done that. <laughs> Whatever. I set it up wrong. Okay, well, anyway. We just, all of this just get six resources. Yeah, we're just gonna have <laughs> six resources. Yes. Oh, I can't believe I did that. Well, anyway. If, just like if, you if, we, just, if we lose the scenario, we're, re we're replaying because of this. You just like hard mode. I just like hard mode. Yeah. The chat knows that's not true. <laughs> they thought what happened when I played on hard mode. All right, uh, so anyway. We are on to the second oath. You descend into the caverns beneath the Order of Daglon's headquarters, unaware of the horrific fate that awaits you in the depths. Uh, and then talk about the suspect enemy who we've already defeated, and then we can spend the blue, red, white, or yellow key to discard each obstacle attached to your location if any investigator has unlocked the depths, advance. So we're trying to unlock the depths. I think it's all your actions, yes? Uh, I lost track of what all happened. Yeah, you moved, moved, did your thing, but you should have resources, right? Did you? Uh, I put it on oh, Pathfinder. Oh, you put it on Pathfinder. Right. Yeah. Okay. All right. Cool. Um, did, are we supposed to shuffle the encounter deck? I mean, every time you usually when you add cards, you have to, right? I think so. often it's not. Always but I mean, we already had them added, so. No, yeah, we have to shuffle this. Great. So they come back. Great. All right. So we do upkeep now. Okay. I swear, Milan is not in this deck. <laughs> I hope he is. I'm I'm like feeling like checking. <laughs> you can check. Well, I'm sure. I'm and then sure. you're gonna be like the next card, and then you're gonna feel bad. I mean, I see him right. Yeah, he was the next card. <laughs> In the last card. In the last card. Yeah. I mean, it doesn't matter. I can't afford him if I draw him. And there, yeah, it doesn't matter. We're fine. We'll be fine. We're fine. Everything is fine. Yeah. Everything is fine. We're just in the middle of hell. <laughs> we'll be okay. Just dark, evil tunnels all around us. <laughs> Indeed. Okay. So. Do an upkeep, right? Yeah. I'll do it again if you want. Oh, you already did? <laughs> yeah. That's funny. All right. Uh, we're at 4 6 Doom. Okay. And encounters. I will get... Mysterious chanting. So let's go find cultist. I'm gonna go grab Wizard of the Order. We'll just put in here. Okay. And then you can go in there and get double clues. I can uh mosey on over with you. Okay. And then I can uh I can punch him. Really great. On a fell's party. Teamwork. Teamwork makes the dream work. Of course, if I miss, we advance, but you know. 
Mm. All right. Because a doom goes on them? Yeah. But it's okay. But, okay. We'll, we'll, we'll be okay, I'm pretty sure. Okay. I get a Serenarian Deep One. Okay. Um, is it engaged with me? It is. It's so you have to add two curse tokens to the bag. Yeah. I just have no way of killing anything. I feel bad. I mean, it's my job. Mm -hmm. But uh, this does create a problem with the Wizard of the Order. Uh, so, uh, a change of uh, plan. At the end of the Mythos phase, I will spend two resources. I have this. I can disengage from this guy and don't. If we need to, we'll see. Um, I'm going to play, uh, play get over here to get the Wizard of the Order over here. Okay. Well, then I'm not going to get double food. It's true. Uh, but if you do that, then Serian Deep One gets on me, and then I get two curse tokens. True. So. That's bad. Yeah. All right, minus two. He's dead. Only you draw the, the minus twos. <laughs> um, this is not an action. And then I will exhaust boxing gloves. We go one, two, three, four, five, six, whatever. Um, interesting. Can't afford this stuff. All right. All right, so I just think I'm gonna punch your guy. I mean, I don't need to stay here. I can just go. Yeah, but I still need to punch your guy. Oh yeah, you don't want him to engage on you. Yeah. Okay. All right, uh, I'm gonna uh, clean them out. Get two resources. Uh, punching that guy. Please don't hit me. <laughs> All right, so we get a negative two, so he takes two damage. Okay. One, punch him again. This is not using an event. Oh, the thing is, I could use my Wayborn Idol to attack him. Oh, why didn't I do that? Okay. Um, you want to just rewind? No, it's fine. Um, actually, I'm going to spend two resources before we do this, sorry. And uh, play my other boxing gloves, because I have a bandolier. And now we're attacking him. I'm going to commit overpower. Up by a bazillion. Okay. Okay. Curse plus one. Curse goes away. And I draw two cards, and he is dead. At some point, I need to spin this blue key. Oh, uh, I got I, I don't remember it. The um, the rule for trading keys is that that you I have to look in the the guide. Chat. Does anybody know in chat? Is the rule that you you take keys or you give keys? I the I, I can't remember. I know you can action trade keys. I don't remember which way it goes. I don't remember. For what? Like, what are you talking about? So, because I need to give you the blue key so that you can use it on the statue. And you can flip it over. So, if I mean, that can Why can't, if we're at the same location, can't you do it? I don't think so, because I think it's something, it's an asset use control, so you need to take the action. Anyway, that's all my turns. Oh, uh, I, I killed a guy with the boxing gloves, so I can through and grab a card. So, we'll do that. So, how am I supposed to get that key from you? Uh, we have to do the trade action. I just need to figure out which which direction it goes. But for now, I would just go try to get some clues. So if I flip this over, it's, <laughs> Excuse me, it's going to be something good? It is something good. Okay. It's very worth doing. You can go ahead and start your action. I'm going to see if I can okay. find the... Uh... Um, I'll just go somewhere. Yeah, I'll safeguard with you wherever you go. Okay. All right, it's a cave. Okay, you well, can... I would take an action to give a key to you. That's how that works. Okay. What did you just look at? The, the manual for the game. Okay. 
So you have to do it on your turn? Yeah. So it's two actions. You have to give it to me, and then I have to do this thing? Yeah. Okay. Well, then we can't do it right now. Um, you can use this action to move from underwater cavern to any flooded cave location. I can take a free action because that increases flood level. It says after it's revealed, it becomes fully flooded. So I will exhaust the waiver when I don't give you the key. <laughs> oh, nice. Um, we need to get out of here, right? Yep. Should I do this first? Uh, how many actions do you have left? Do you have two actions left? Oh, you just yeah. Pathfinder. Yeah, I would use it. I would do it for sure. Did I Pathfinder? I'm going to say you did. I guess, well, it's it's, yeah. <laughs> Um. Okay, so I have three actions. So yeah, we'll, we'll spin the key. Yep. So it goes up here. Yeah, you flip it over. All right. Um, you can fast trigger, exhaust the statue to deal one damage to a humanoid enemy. Now I can finally do damage. Yeah, and you then, did that before, but you had to put curse tokens in. I know, it's just not worth it. Yeah. Um, and then you can exhaust the statue, remove two curse tokens from the chaos bag, and replace them with an equal number of blessed tokens. We should just do that right now, right? Yeah. Yeah. We should. We should do that. Just do it. Okay. Cool. All right. Um. So I have two more actions. You do. So I'll just move. Use this move action here. Okay. If you do that, I can't go with you. Which oh really? Maybe it's okay, but but it's so much easier than like, going back. And... It's fine. It's good. You can you can <sighs> you can leave me. I won't be upset. We're trying to get um. I We're think... trying to trying to unlock the final depths. Yeah. Um... I think it's totally fine for me to to go to another location without me. I'll. Okay, I'll just. It's not like I have valuable friends anyway. Okay. This is another cave. Underground river cannot be fully flooded. Right. And after it's revealed, increase its flood level. Yeah, oh, this is a victory um, point. So I have one more action, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'll investigate. Mm -hmm. All right, and this time I will use... First, I will burn them in that well. Mm, not really. About 45 minutes. We already had dinner, so you're just gonna have to warm some of it up. You're a tough mom. <laughs> <laughs> now I'm being nice, letting him eat. Yeah, true. Okay, okay. I'll start with this, mm -hmm. and then I will use deduction, and I will use a lock pick. You can't use lock picks because it's uh, burning the mineral. Oh, because I use that. Okay, so let me see. I think I might be okay. Wait, let me see. Four, five. Six, seven. Mm -hmm. I would investigate mm -hmm. without block picks and then use your lock picks with the the um or with the deduction because if you succeed by two, you get. Only have one action left. Okay, uh, so I won't do this. Okay. Okay, so I'll just use the lock picks with my deduction. Okay. Um. So I'm at eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Mm -hmm. Okay. Twelve to beat four. Minus two. I finally there you pulled go. it. You pulled the net minus two. Yes. Right. So um, I succeeded by six, which means nothing. Okay. You get three clues. Oh, I got this upgraded deduction. You sure do. That was really nice. Yeah, it's a good card. Excellent. Smart move putting that in your deck. Thank you. <laughs> All right. <laughs> <laughs> Is that it? <laughs> All right, we're doing upkeep. That was your full yeah. turn. All right. There's my buddy. Okay. All right, we are at five of six doom. Draw a counter card, I get locked door, goes right here in the inward cover. Is this exhausted forever? Nope. It's oh. right, right, unexhausted. Let's just do it every round. <laughs> just keep doing it. Yeah. But what did you get? I got a locked door. You always get that. Okay. Heralds of the Deep. Wait, Test wasn't there supposed to be a locked door here? What happened to it? I don't know. There was. I shuffled it back in. I shouldn't have. Okay, well, just continuing to make our lives more difficult. It's fine. All right. Oh, because when we like 
cleared all those other yeah. things that stayed. I guess I'll just grab the other lock door and put it there. I think that's slightly cheating, but I mean, it definitely should not have gone away. But we don't know if this lock door that is true was that one, but I don't know. What okay. difference does it make? Doesn't matter. Okay. Right? I mean, I could have gotten a nastier encounter card, so. Oh, okay. All right, well, I have to test three willpower. And it's not fully flooded, so not five. For each point you fill by, add one curse token to the chaos bag. That's not too bad. Mm -hmm. Right? Mm -hmm. Okay. You have a window during this test where you could do exhaust that thing to add blood tokens to the chaos bag. You yeah, let's just do that now. All right. Where's the where's the point? So we're gonna take two cursed out? Mm -hmm. Okay. Should I just spill them all out because I... Okay. There you go. Wait. Oh, yeah. The blessed goes in there. Mm -hmm. Okay. And the blessed gives you... Plus two, draw another. So it's like my elder sign, but better. <laughs> <laughs> well, if your elder sign on investigate can... Be oh, yeah, that's true. Yeah. No, uh, yeah. Okay, I'm just kidding. Okay, um, now I'll test. I'm 2v3. Minus one. I fail. <laughs> <laughs> so what happens? You have to... Um, put, um, okay, so I'm, I'm failed by two. I failed by three, right? You were... No, I was 2v3. Oh, then you 1v3. Minus one. So here's those first tokens. Yeah, so we'll put them back in. Yeah. Okay. That works. All right. Okay. All right, then. So. So I know I need to get that last clue and um, I guess go to another cavern. Mm -hmm. OK. Do you? Um, maybe I will just go to the middle so that I can be ready to yeah, you want to move before me, and then you can yeah. safeguard with yeah, me. Yeah, safeguard with you. Yeah. Okay. That makes a lot of sense. Um, I'm going to action one. I'm going to move. Action two. I don't think there's anything that we would use handcuffs for here. It's hard to think of. There's a couple things that... Um, like, I'll put out the hollow mirror. I think I don't want to quite do that yet. I'll uh, spin two. To put out handcuffs for no reason. Okay. And then I will... Uh, you know, those are great for my investigates. Like if you drag somebody with us. Yes, yeah. If there's anybody worth... That's why I put it in this deck, in fact. Oh. Okay, I took a resource. That was your three actions? Mm -hmm. I moved. Okay. I played that. I'll Pathfinder in here, and then... Wait, did you want to get that clue? Oh, yeah, I did. <laughs> okay, um... I'll do a lock picks. Actually, before I do this, do I have an action to put down Lucky Cigarette Case? Sure. Okay. Okay, and I'll do a lock picks. So I'm at 8, 9, 10. Kurtz? Minus three. I think I'm still okay. You succeed by yeah. one. Yeah, I succeed by one. So I, I break this. You do break one, yep. Okay. And you could exhaust your lucky series to draw one card. Might as well, because there's, no, there's nothing bad in there. Yeah. Hey, it's another lock picks. Well, you know, for the one that you're breaking. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that is your hand, okay. So that was one, and then I'll Pathfinder. And then for two, I'll we'll just make our way around. Yeah, that's good. Okay. I'll uh, stay for with you. Oh wow, five shroud. What? Just read it. Okay. Forced after doorway to the depths is revealed, place the set aside green key on the location with the most clues. Which happens to be this one. Okay. Investigators at the doorway to the depths spend the green key and six clues as a group. 
remember that you have unlocked the final depths. That's what we're trying to do. Yeah. So that's good that we found it. Yes, but the problem is on this really annoying thing with the locked door. Locked door's not too bad. Yeah. At least we don't have to... That's what we were searching for, right? Yeah. How many clues are, do we need? Yeah. Six. Are yeah. there some victory locations around there here? There are. Yeah. So you, you want to just clear them all? I don't know. We're, our game clock's getting kind of tight, so I don't okay. know. Okay. Yeah. Um, okay, so we just, um, I have, do I have one more action? Because I, path, I investigated Pathfinder mode. Right. Yeah. So I can try to get this clue. Uh, I don't think we need that clue. Oh, you don't need this clue. No. Okay, so I'll just move back. Okay. We're going to come back here. Yeah, we have to come back here once okay. we get the green key and enough, cl and enough clues. Okay, I'll just move back then. All right. Um... Is it? All right, let's do a key. Okay. We tapped this this round, right? Yeah, we did. Yeah, okay. Mm -hmm. All right. With the ginger advances, the silence that pervades the building retreats as a sinister chanting rises from the depths, each uncanny syllable a reminder of the order's inhuman origins. What was once the rhythmic drip drip of trickling water is now a distant resounding roar as of rushing flood water. There's also something else, the rumbling of something enormous, something that stirs under the bedrock. Add four curse tokens to the chaos bag. A giant, massive beast with tentacles? Or something like that? Probably. I don't know, I'm guessing. <laughs> Can I see the bag? In there. Um, it's worth noting that, that we could now uh, exhaust this to remove all the curse tokens from the bag. All of them? It says two. Oh. Is that worth doing? Probably. Or we can put more in later. Well, let's do it now. Okay. We're about to do uh, treacheries, right? We are. Yeah, let's do it now. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven. There's one more. Eight. Yeah. That was worth it. Yeah. Here's the other two over here. All right. All right. Good deal. Actually, there's probably not a window to do that, but there will be a window since we have a test thing. Whatever you say, here. I'm not going <laughs> to. I'm not going to be a stickler. <laughs> All right. Uh, so we draw encounters now. Okay. And this just says it's the same thing as before. The building rumbles to its foundations. Something sinister is happening deep below the halls of the Order of Dagon. If you don't stop it, who knows what may be unleashed. And it's the same force about uh, fully flooded locations. All right. I get an Acolyte. So I guess I'm going to put him here. We can't stay in this area, right? Yeah, if we start and end in that area, it'll be a problem. Okay. No, like if we end our turn in this area, we take five damage. No, if you start and they fully flooded and end and they fully flooded. Okay, so we can move in there. Yeah. And not take five damage. Right, unless we start at a fully flooded location. Like if you, okay. if you were to draw a treachery right now that make this fully flooded, then that would cause us a problem. Oh, <sighs> yeah. So okay. Draw your treachery and let's see if that comes true. Okay. Nope. It's this. It's the Sizinji. Sizigi. Sizigi. I keep wanting to say synergy. Synergy. Sizigi. Um, how many resources do you have? I have one. All right, let's do that. Okay. We're gonna lose resources. All right. So that's the thing. All right. Uh, can you handle that locked door, or do I need to handle that locked door? Um. I can handle it, for sure. I got it. You got it? Yeah. All right. As long as I don't pull out of them. Okay. <laughs> Sounds good. Okay. Why don't you go in and do that? I'll uh, tank the uh, Acolyte. Okay. Excuse me. Okay, so I'm at four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. And there's no curses in the bag, so. Okay. 
Come on, Elder Stein. Minus four. I'm one up. So I, I won. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's gone. Mm -hmm. Whoops. Okay, and then um, you have the Acolyte. I do. All right, and then we have to get these to get this? Yes. Okay. So I Pathfinder in there, by the way. Yeah, sure. Yeah. I believe you. Um, <laughs> as always. As always. Yeah. So I still I only so I have two actions left. Right. Okay. So um let me put no, I don't have any resources. Yeah. Um I'll just investigate with my lock picks. Mm -hmm. Um so I'm at eight, nine, ten. Me too. Yeah. Minus one. All right, take that. You take the other one too. Uh, oh, you have an enemy. Yeah. I'll do that. Okay. So one more action. And you can look at cigarette kids. Because you're. I was at ten v two, and I got a minus one. Yeah. So I get to look at seven cards. Yep. Okay. Just like, like the rest of your deck. Three, four, five, six. Wow, that was exactly right. Um, and I have like no money, so. Oh, look at those. Yeah, the Awakened Mantle is the one that, like, basically, because all these are flooded, just turns into another Pathfinder. Oh, I'll take that then. Yeah, that's really good. Okay. All right. Is Milan in there? Yeah, he is. <laughs> and you can take that green key as well. Is that an action for me? No, you can just pick it up. Okay, so I have one more action. You pathfinder, you did the lock door, and then you investigated. So yeah, you have well, you have one more action. Um, one more action. So you could leave here. I mean, you can use this ability to, to go to another location. Oh, let's do that. Where do you want to go? You keep going around the horn. Where we haven't been? Yeah. Right here? Mm -hmm. All right, so we're going to move here. You said you can't follow me, though, when I use that. Well, one. I can use an action. I just can't take forever with you. It's fine. Okay. Um, wait a second. Why are we... Oh, well, we're exploring these for victory points. Yes. Is that why? Because yeah. we already have what we need for right here. This is true. Yeah. Okay. So this is no victory points. It just says it's plus one shroud while it is partially flooded and plus two shroud while it is fully flooded after it's revealed. Randomly, oh, it does say randomly choose one of the set aside face down keys and place it. So do I want that key? Yeah, could be good. Okay. All right, so I'm done. Yep. Uh, I'm going to let's see the back. I'm going to um, evade this guy. Uh, actually, I'm going to use the, uh, I say evade this guy, I'm going to use the handcuffs on this uh, acolyte. It won't remove the doom, but I could, we could still keep him alive for a little bit and walk around with him. And uh, you could get double clues or something. So anyway, I'm evading him. I'm at 5, 6, B, 2. Minus 4, so I pass. So he's got the handcuffs, he's exhausted. I will re-engage him. So he's going to hang around with us. And then I'll use... Why action. did you put your bandolier on him? Because I thought my bandolier was a handcuff. Oh, okay. But it's not. Okay. Keeping me honest. All right. Just wondering. So, I don't play that, you know, <laughs> guardian stuff. Guardian stuff? Yeah. Right. I don't know. Guardian stuff. All right, so uh, that's it. Let's do upkeep. Okay. All right. Counter. Uh, we're at two of six doom. Drawing. Uh, I guess it's a G. We each lose three resources. Okay. We need resources anyway. That's both of those, though, so that's good. I got a stone barrier attached to the nearest location without a stone barrier. Okay. Um, is this location flooded? It is. 
It's not partially flooded? It's partially flooded. Okay, what well, says if is flooded, it gains surge. Yeah, partially flooded is flooded. Okay, so we have to surge this? Yes, that's, yeah, that's the key. Okay, so we can't move out without doing these tests? Without doing one of those tests. Right. Yeah. Okay. Why, are you sure on that? Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, and we are now in act two, so I have to test three agility. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, I'd take a damage. Uh, so I'm at five agility. And then two fight. Three agility. Oh, I have to do two. all of those tests? Mm -hmm. Oh, well, I might fail that. For each test you fail, you take a damage. Okay. Um. Okay, well, let's see the agility first. I feel like there was a card that I grabbed. <gasps> I'm so confused. I'm at 5v3. I got a bless token. Okay. I have to draw another one, right? I'm at 7v3. Mm -hmm. uh, a tentacle. It's about to happen. A blessed tentacle. Yeah, bless, bless, bless t tentacles like a thing. Okay, so I take a damage. And you gotta take the other test, and then yeah, take a damage for each one you feel All right, now I'm testing two fight against two fight. So I'm testing even. Mm -hmm. I failed. Okay. Got minus four. All right. So I'll take another damage, and that's mm -hmm. it. Um, I'm going to go ahead and go, I think. I will test the stone barrier. Okay. I am at, uh, 5, 6, to be 2. Nice. Alright, we're at 6 feet 2. Pretty close to it. Okay, I get, uh, the, the tablet, minus 3. I pass, so we exhaust that. Then I am going to um, take two resources because we're through all the physics. I have a hollow mirror in my hand, so I will be able to heal your damage. All right, that's me. I'm not too bad. Okay. All right. That was your. So what was your turn? What did you do? I exhausted this so we can mm -hmm. get out of here, and mm -hmm. then I took, took took two resources. Okay. So let's just move. Wait, do you want to get these clues? Why? You can pick up that key. Oh yeah, the key. Okay. Could be helpful. Okay. I just have to straight up investigate. You can use lockpicks. Yeah. And you'll get two clues because I got this guy here. Oh, great. Okay. So oh, I'm at <laughs> I'm at ten. Um I'll mm, no. I'll do that. You get two resources. But then you can't use log picks. That okay, these cards should not be in the same deck. <laughs> <laughs> like I cannot do this then. You're, you're, you're not wrong. You're not wrong. And I guess if I had some more boosts, but I can't get them out because I can't afford them. Yeah. All right, I'm at 10. Well, then I'm going to do the perception then. Wait, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. No, I'm not going to do the perception. 10 to beat what? Two, 3. 3? Uh, 4, actually, because that gets plus 1 trial. Okay, so that's a minus four. So that brings it to six. So I, I beat it. Yes. Yep. By two. So you don't break your lockpicks. And you get two clues. Mm, might as well do this. And you can take... Actually, I'll take this key. Okay. For reasons. It is the yellow key. Okay, so that that was um one action. Mm -hmm. So there's just move, move. Yep. Okay. Or Pathfinder. Oh right. Pathfinder, move. So and I'm bickering with you. So we still have one more action here. Mm -hmm. So there's two clues. 
Tidal pool gets plus one shroud while it is partially flooded, plus two when it's fully flooded. Randomly choose one of the set aside face down keys and place it on tidal pool without looking at it. Was this fully flooded? Uh, oh, you know what? This was fully flooded too, which means actually uh, because we should have. No, wait. We don't increase it. No, no. This is partially flooded. No, yeah, it's partially flooded. It's correct. Okay. I'm looking for another key token. Here it is. Okay, and there's two clues there. Okay. I have one more action. You do? But you're with me, right? I'm with you. But, uh, but my, you can't use your thing again. So you can only get one clue because you already used it once. Yeah, so. I gotta get some cards out of my hand. So, what do you need? Is it with the the book? I'll help you in about thirty minutes. Okay, well that's cute. <laughs> <laughs> he's learning the program. He needs to. Uh, he's learning the program. So I'm gonna I'm gonna help him. He's studying his book. Yes, it's so awesome. Cute. I bought him this big old book on programming. Um, I need to get rid of cards. Can I take a resource? Sure. And then I can put down this fast. Yep. Okay. Okay. All right. Then. And then I. Yeah, that was my action. It was mm -hmm. taking it. Okay. All right. We are at three of six doom. I don't know that we need to keep going for victory points. Maybe we just need to, to, to finish this up. Get a card and resource. We'll take a horror. I can kill this acolyte. And, uh, grab that car. All right, we, uh, did I put a doom? Yeah, because you just, yeah. you did, you said the three of six doom yeah, thing. Okay. Like the tone in your voice was yeah yeah because I, like I, I did that for some reason before drew my account my but i remember you saying All that right. i got the deep one put two curses in hmm okay you want to read that the two three two after you, you add two curse tokens to the chaos bag all right uh-oh mysterious chanting Place two doom on the nearest cultist. Is that him? That would be him. But because he has handcuffs on him, he can't. Oh, you know what? Actually, before you draw that, I'm mm -hmm. sorry. Before you draw that, I'm going to exhaust the wave burner idol uh, to punch and scenario and deep one. Uh, I will just use clean them out. Getting two resources. Many of Can you go ahead and take this out? Take do this? Uh, yeah, we'll do that. So I take the two curses out and put two blessings in. Yeah. Uh, there's two curses in here. There's one. There's two. And yeah, we'll put two blessings in. Okay. Cool. All right. So we're cleaning them out with a vicious blow. Uh, that is minus four. I don't fail. He is dead. And goes to this card. I will cost my two boxing gloves twice. And while I'm doing that, you can resolve okay. your nearest chanting, which does nothing, actually. Does nothing, and so doesn't have surge or anything. Nope. Nice. That's true. Okay. Oh, well, while you find your card. Actually. Can I get something else to drink? Yeah. Okay. I'll be right back. Sure.
And then we're doing boxing gloves again. Good. All right. I am going to go first, I think. Hey, right, I will uh, play stand together with you. Okay. So many cards. And resources. All right, then I will spend my second action. I will spend two for a hollow mirror. And that will get me Soothing Melody. I will play the Soothing Melody to heal one of my horror and one of your damage. Oh, thank you. I'm pretty good. All right. Okay. It will help. And that's my three turns, three actions. Okay, I'm gonna do this just because I just want to. Okay, mm -hmm. I'm gonna take a resource and play Milan. Okay. Is that okay? Mm -hmm. Okay. Finally. I know that is two actions, but. Um, it will help me to pay for things. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. And then, um, I will investigate. I don't even know if he was worth it, honestly. But we're going to stick around here and get these clues, right? I mean, you should be able to get them in one action and then we can just get out of here. Yeah, because we have an enemy. Yes, I got this. Uh, well, this is my last action. Mm -hmm. But then you can No, no, I have a out. Pathfinder. Yep. Yeah, okay, I can Pathfinder. So all this stuff is back again. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, so I am at. I'm, I'm going to lock picks. Mm -hmm. Because why not? So I'm at 10, 11, 12. Mm -hmm. To beat what? Three? Three. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, actually, five. No, four. But yeah. 12 to beat 4. Yeah. Okay. Minus 4. Yeah. So that's 8. Yeah. I guess I'll take this last card. All right. Then I take yeah. a heart. No, I don't take a heart yet. Take the two clues. Yeah. And I'll take a resource. And I'll take and the key. You'll take the key? Okay. Yeah. All right. This is my hand right now. <laughs> <laughs> this is all that stuff. Yeah. Welcome to the, welcome to drawing cards. That's the experience. Okay, let's Pathfinder okay. to anywhere. I guess, well, we have to go here. Oh yeah, that's right. We're not connected. Yep. This just means we can't investigate, right? Yeah. Okay. All right. So let's, uh, let's uh, do a cute. All right, so now I take a horror. Yep. I guess Milan can do it. Your good friend, Dr. Milan. All right, we are at four of six doom. Wait, I gotta discard some stuff. Hold on. Okay. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, ten. Hold on, I gotta discard a bunch of stuff. Okay, I'm ready. All right. 
for for fixed doom. And a counter card, I get the Priest of Dagon. Spawn in an empty location. When he would be defeated or evaded, if there's doom on it, instead heal all damage from it ready and place one doom on it. At the end of the round, the Priest of Dagon is ready and there's no doom on it, place one doom on it. So I think are we get, I think we just need to go for the end now. I don't think we need to do victory point hunt because we're very close. Sure. So I think we'll put him here, because that's where we're going, and I can just engage him on the way by. So what are, what what are we doing with this green, white, and yellow key? The green key is what we use to unlock the... Okay. Yep, to advance. What are we doing with the white and yellow key? Something that you don't know yet. Okay. But, but I do. But are we going to need any more keys? Uh, well, that's all the keys in the game are out, actually. Okay. All right. That sounds good. Should I go? You're, you're in counter burn? Oh, yeah. Title alignment. Choose a location where there's at least one investigator. So that's where we are. We have mm -hmm. to increase the flood level and we each take a damage. Okay. Okay. So you take a damage. And I can take a free action because of the Graveborn Idol. Okay. But I think I will not. I can't think of anything useful that I would actually want to do. So I'll just save it for now. You could take a resource. I could. I think I'm okay. I think that I, I think there's just... I, I, the flood level might go up again? I think it might. We'll see. Okay. Um, So I think we just want to go in and unlock this, or do we want to push our luck and try to get more clues? More victory Is points. Is it worth it? I think, I think it's very tight right now. Like, it'll end badly. Other, It'll... Oh yeah, I actually don't know what happens if we do them out, but I can't imagine it's good. Okay. Sure. I have this, I have an obfuscation left. I can do that action. That's Chris. He's checking us out. They meant to drop in earlier. They got distracted by dinner. Oh, Chris, who's coming tomorrow? Yeah. Oh. Marvel. Marvel. Hey, Chris. <laughs> See you tomorrow. That's exciting. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay. So I'll Pathfinder in there. Okay, that guy will, I'll uh, safeguard, that guy will engage with me. Oh, okay, so I was saying I could use this to um, do the action. Oh, uh, it, no, it's fine. I, I want him okay. with me. All right, so we're going to spend the green key and six clues. And rem remember that we unlocked the final deaths. Mm -hmm. Okay. A lot of clues. All right. All right. Um. And that is this. Wait. So let me just remember. I just did one action. Yes. Okay. Loyalty. Uh, the more you explore the caverns, the more alien and inhuman the architecture becomes. Soon it feels like you have crossed the threshold of another world entirely. It's reminiscent of the ruins you saw beneath Devil Reef, but those depths are miles from here, right? Or is this network of ca caves so vast it spawns the entirety of Innsmouth? Soon you come across upon a grand set of doors in the center of the web of gilded corridors. Many other paths stem from this hall, but it is this door and this strange heavy breathing that thrums throughout the walls and floor that calls to you. Put this other side layer of Dagon into play, fully flooded. Oh, I was wrong. Okay, whatever. Uh, put the set-aside Dagon enemy into play in the layer of Dagon uh, deep in slumber side face up check the agenda if it is uh, 1a add 10 curse tokens if it is 2a add 5 curse tokens it's 3 so we don't add any curse tokens nice so you know oh, I'm, I'm sorry with you so we put um the layer of deck on the play here it is fully flooded you have that yeah you got the uh, little arrow let me put it down here so, grab an arrow. And then we got to put uh, Dagon here. So, he is deep in slumber. Uh, Dagon is slumbering. He cannot attack or engage and is immune to investigate our actions and player card effects. Forced after an investigator at this location fails a skill test, place one resource on Dagon. Then, if there are at least uh, four resources on him, flip him. Spend one key to remove one resource from Dagon. He is here. So we don't want to fail, otherwise he wakes up. Okay. 
So I have two actions left. Mm -hmm. Should I go in there and like if we if we end our turn there? No, if we end if we end our turn and begin a turn. Right. Basically, if we end if we stop we stop this turn in there. Mm -hmm. Well, so we take five damage. If you start in in your turn there, yes, you take five damage. Okay, so I can go in there and stay mm -hmm. for a minute. Okay. All right, six clues. After you enter Lair of Dagon, test your lowest skill three. If you fail, take a horror. And then as an action, test three willpower or three agility. If you succeed, place one of your clues on the current act. You may spend one key to place one or more of your clues on the current act. So we have to get six clues on the act. Mm -hmm. And I have to be testing agility for this. Okay, yeah. great. All right, well, my lowest skill is my fight or my willpower. Mm -hmm. So I'm probably going to be taking a horror. Okay. So I'm testing 2v3. Yep. Let's put this negative four back in. Um, do you want... Wait, that's my discard. Are there first tokens negative? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. No, there's not. Okay. I just want to see if I have any willpower. Oh, I have this thing. Yeah. I'm not going to use it, right? No. Okay. So that puts me at 4v3. 4v3? Okay. I'll uh, commit Randall Cho. So you can be 5, 6v3, not by 3. I'll commit this too. Okay. 7v3. 7v3. Okay. okay. There's two. Nice. Yeah. Put it out there. What? Put it out there. You pass. Yep. Okay. So but now, I, because I passed part of I have to do the same thing. Okay. I'm attesting two intellect. Uh, or three intellect. Um, do you have any intellect icons for me? I'm going to commit. How much did I just succeed by? I succeeded by. You succeeded by. You were at two, three, four. Oh, were... was it 7v3? Yeah. So you succeeded by two. Okay, so my next skill test is going to be two left. All right, I'm committing this. I'm up by one. Do you have any uh, any intellect icons by any chance? Intellect. That is my thing. No. Um. Sure, I'll I'll give you three. All right. So I'm at two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, three. That's one. All right, you get to draw two cards. Oh, thank you. All right. So if you will peruse the teachings of the order, there might be something on there that might be relevant. Just pointing that out to you. Is that a non-sanctum location? It is a non-sanctum location. So we can take, we can remove the flood token. We could. Let's do it. Okay. Nice. Okay. Um, do I do I have all my actions right now, or what? I don't know where we're at. Um, you took an, you have taken two actions. You have one action left. What did I do? You uh, you pathfindered in. You did the thing to unlock this, and then you moved in. So you've you did the action to unlock. So I, have, it. I have one action left. Correct. Oh yeah, I was gonna investigate. Yep. Okay. Did I already tap this? The lock picks? Yeah. Uh, you shouldn't have, no. Okay. Okay. So I'm at 12. Mm -hmm. Did I use my enemy thing yet? Enemy thing? You know, like... Do a damage. No, I you could get extra clips. No, no, you haven't. Oh, okay. Zero. Okay. So we get two clues. Mm-hmm. Well, you spent a lot of clues, right? But you're... I have I have eight clues now. I spent six. Yeah. All right. Um, did I tap this yet? Mm, I don't think so. I don't think so. So I was just up... You haven't taken tests. I was just up by eight. No, I was up by nine. Yeah. 
I always forget to unexhaust stuff. <laughs> Um, am I going to have to do damage? I have like no money. I'll take this. Okay. Alright, uh, I am going to, uh, play Clean the Mounts on this Priest of Dagon. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eight, three, minus two. So I'm successful, but when he would be defeated, instead, uh, heal all damage from it and place one doom on it. So put a doom on him. <laughs> okay, then we will just punch him. Minus two, he takes the damage. And we'll punch him again. Plus. Plus one. He is dead. Nice. And I think we're okay with, uh, this other guy surviving, right? Because we're, yeah, of course, 16 is fine. He's dead. I get to exhaust my blocks and blocks twice. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, and do it again. I'm just going to grab Monster Flare. All right, and then um, actually I will uh, do a damage to Grit and grab Clue. Nice. I got a clue. Do we want to be focused on putting clues on the act or clearing this place? Uh, both. I think we can get all the rest of the clues next turn. Okay. And start putting them on. It'd be fairly easy to do. Did I get a resource when I got that the last time I got clues? Um. No. I don't not. think I did. Nope. Yeah. Okay. All right. Here we go. Oh, upkeep. Upkeep. Yes. Okay. You gotta say that. I. Do. I'm gonna forget to fix everything. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Wait. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right. Uh, we are at. 506 doom. Doom, 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 doom. Okay, initiate a Dagon in the empty location. While initiative Dagon has no doom on it, it gets plus two fight and plus two evade. I'll put it here. Put it on the doorway? Yeah. Okay. Yep. Secret gathering hex. Add one curse token to the chaos bag. Test four willpower. If you fail, place one doom on each. Hope this enemy and take one horror, and then it's worse if you reveal a curse token. Did we tap this yet? We have not. Can we go ahead and do that? Mm, no. Why? Because you might put more curse tokens in, right? Okay, you wanted to get rid of the one curse token? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, you can do that. Put a curse well, token in. Well, to you have to add this curse token in. Right. So okay. then you take that curse token and put a blessed token in. Well, we're taking, we're removing two curse tokens and replacing them with two blessed. Yes, but there's only one in there because of that one. Oh. That's fine. Well, then I definitely won't have to do that two horror and... Yeah, that's fair. I don't know. Yeah, I just put the blessed in. Okay. Um, all right. 
So I'm testing 2v4 and I've got nothing. I could, I could use this. I think failing it's not the biggest thing. Okay. Okay, so I'm gonna fail. And we have to put a doom on each cultist enemy and take one heart. Mm-hmm. <gasps> but I don't actually, hold on. Okay, yeah, so now, I'm, now I'm even. <laughs> Not as exciting as you first thought, right? I know. I, I think it's plus two. That's what it is. Okay. Wait, no. There shouldn't be a curse token in the back. Yeah. What happened? That means that I miscounted. So, yeah. Okay. Fine. Zero. <laughs> the almighty bless. We passed. Okay, good deal. Good deal. All right. Fun times. All right. So, let, um, at the end of that phase, I'm going to spend two to play i have a get over here right yes get over here get over here okay uh so i'm attacking this one i am at five six seven eight nine ten the four and i get a negative three so she is dead i will do a damage to grit Grab a clue. Alright. Anything else? Uh, yeah. I guess I have three clues. I must have put one aside. So I'm trying to remember when I got another clue. What did I get another clue for? Grit? Hmm. Um, I guess I'm just I picked up a clue at one point. I thought I thought I said I would need a clue later. I don't remember why I got one. I'm gonna say I'll need two clues and just okay. Trust that uh, my my reading is correct. Okay. Uh, so what I think happens now is we haven't failed any test to put any resources in Dagon. That's amazing. Um, is you get those two clues and then just start taking the test to put the clues on. How many clues do we have to put on the act? I didn't even read the act. Six. Right? All right. Put if there are six, if there are three clues per investigator, um, advance. Okay, sounds good. So we can do this several ways, right? We can spend keys. You have two keys. Uh, so the the keys just put an additional clue on. Since I only have two clues, I can only put two clues on. Wait. So I test three agility to put the clue on the current act. Mm -hmm. You may spend one key to place one or more of your clues. Yeah. On the current act. So since I have the keys, I could, oh, I could give you my keys though. So then you could investigate. Oh, but I have the acolyte. Do you have a deduction by any chance? I don't think so. Okay. No. All right. I think it's probably fine. I think you just try to put as many clues on as you can. Investigate two clues and then just do the thing. Okay. Did you want to kill the acolyte? No. I'm going to, but I'm going to go do it after you do so you can get the two clues. Okay. I'll investigate with my lockpicks. Mm -hmm. And I'll add this. Momentum. Nice. That's yeah. Brilliant. Okay. <laughs> so I'm at... Well, that's a good move. <laughs> Thanks. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. To beat 3... Okay, so that's minus five. Five. So, um, so succeeded by five. Yeah. Okay. And I'm gonna take an extra clue because there's an enemy here. Mm -hmm. Um. Okay, and now I have two more actions. You do. Okay, so we're gonna do that test. Mm -hmm. Okay. So my agility. Did you want a lucky cigarette case? Yeah, I I succeeded by five. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Take that. Mm -hmm. Okay, so my agility is four five. Versus zero, because then momentum. Nice. Five is zero. So I won't use this right now. Okay? Yep. 
That is a negative four if you fail, but you okay, don't fail. Okay, I don't fail. Yeah. So we're gonna put a clue here. Mm -hmm. And then we'll test again. This is done, right? Yep. Okay, so I'm at four, five, six, seven to beat three. Uh so you're up by four? Yeah. Should I go up more? Yeah, we um yeah, I'm just trying to think if there's anything I want to commit to this. But yeah, you want to be up by five because of the skulls. Wait, does that put me up? Let's it does. See. Yeah. Four oh yeah. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Mm-hmm. Okay. Oh yeah, those skulls are nasty. They sure are. Yeah. Elder sign. <laughs> which is nice. whatever. <laughs> All right. All right. I used to really like this token. <laughs> hey, I still like this token. <laughs> All right. I will, uh, I'm going to punch the Oh, and I get to draw it hard. Punching the acolyte uh, by a billion. Did I pick the resource when I got the clue? The, the one I got the, I don't think I did not. Okay. I thought you did. I keep yeah. forgetting to because I spent this whole game without Milan. Yep. Yeah. Plus one, he is dead. My boxing gloves aren't exhausted. That's, yeah. I guess I didn't do it when I killed that other guy. So I will do them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And we will get. Do you have any left icons? Oh wait, there's no more clues left. Never mind. I'll just grab that. No, now we're just agility and willpower. Yeah. My willpower is fairly decent now. Because I can boost. We just have to do four more. I am going to take uh, the next two actions to give you my two keys. Actually, why? No, no, I'll give you one key. Then you can spend it. You think you could have time to to look at those other areas? <laughs> <laughs> no, we have one screen left. Oh, okay. Greedy. What? It says four, right? It's four of six. Yeah. Okay. We have one turn left. Oh, we're about to go have another doom. Yes. We're about to yeah. Have okay. Doom. Um. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine is yep. Why not? All right. Then I will take the test. Um, I'm testing willpower. I am at because uh, I have the bandolier. My willpower is four, so I'm at four B three. I'll spend the two off physical training to be four, five, six. Um, I'll commit stand together to be seven, eight. That's enough, right? Eight, eight, three. Okay. Good deal. Let's put this plus one back in. Yeah. That is the tablet. I do pass. I will spend my key to put both of my clues on the act. Oh, spending the key goes on here. So now you can give me a by six. Oh, one, one more. Yeah. Oh, okay. So you get two total. Okay. So I'll just, I'll do the same thing. Yeah. You just do one cast, pass one cast. Okay. All right. So everything ready is. Wait, what are we doing upkeep right now? Yeah, we're doing upkeep. Okay. Oh wait, that's not the right thing. This is the right thing. I got coming more. Oh, I just got the bad guys. Okay. Uh, I gotta drop the card. Probably will drop that. Do I have to deal with them? If I Put those two clues on there. Uh, is that a parlay? 
No, what it's do you mean? So you'll take two damage if you do that. From why? Uh, from attack of opportunity. Okay, but if I can avoid the attack of opportunity. Oh, obfuscation. Yeah, that's true. No, or this in the shadows. True. Like, then we're done, right? Yes. So I don't have to deal with them. Right. Okay. All right. Uh, we get Heralds of the Deep. Three willpower, five instead. If your location is flooded, which point you fail by, add one curse token to the cast bag. If you cannot, okay, who cares? I will, uh, I'm at um, 43, I'll spend two off for the refrain, 35, 63. Minus one, I pass. Esoteric Ritual, Hex, test four willpower. If you fail, either choose and discard two cards from your hand or discard an asset. Whatever. You care? No, we're about to be done, right? Yep. I don't really... Are you going to draw for me or something? No, I was just oh. playing Nervous Energy. Okay. I am 2v4. Mm -hmm. And I'm blessed. <laughs> and I pass. We haven't built one test to put a thing on Dagon yet. Nice. Yeah, you can just use your obfuscation and do the test. And then... Yeah, so um, it's agility. So I'm at four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, that seems good. Nine to beat three. Yep. Minus three, so six. So I'm three up. And you spend your clue, and you put two clues on. Yeah, I spend my key. Key, yes, and put two clues on. Yeah, I'll put two clues on. All, All right, right, and we advance. Can I read it? Yes, absolutely. Okay. A sudden stillness permeates the chamber. The only sound you hear is the gentle rippling of the reflecting pool inside the cold's hidden lair and the pounding of your own heart in your chest as you struggle to understand what you have seen. Whatever ritual the order has what was performing has been disrupted by your hand, but Agent Dawson does not look relieved. This is a memory, right? Like... Yeah. Oh, okay, right. He says through choked breaths. His hands shake as he lowers his weapon. Come on, quickly. We have another task to perform. Another task? You have no idea what Dawson is talking about. He notices your confusion and shakes his head. No time to explain. Follow me. Then a fuzzy darkness overtakes your memories. Dun, dun, dun. So this whole thing with a memory. Yep. Okay, in your campaign log, record the Order's Ritual was disrupted. If Dagon... Yeah, he's asleep. De yep. Definitely asleep. <laughs> Um, in your campaign log, record Dagon still slumbers. All right. Otherwise, he would be awakened and enraged. So I'm glad that we ended like that. Yeah, no. Yeah. So look, how, many, how many did we get? We got one, two, three. Uh, this one. Four, five. Okay. Five BP. Plus Let five. me see what we missed. Wait. Not one there. Oh, there's one. Yeah. We got five, and we got six from the other one, so we're, we have 11 to spend. That's Wait, no, we do. So it would just be that one. Yeah. It's not too bad. We did good. It's a hard scenario, though. It would have been less hard if I hadn't put the syzygies in. Right yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right, well, I'm going to sign up. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Uh, next time, I will actually make sure that I have encounter cards that I can put up so you guys can follow things better. I just made a boo-boo with the software, so... These things happen. Anyway, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. I will see you next time on Winging It.